As I walk by here, I see the open door and I'm like, what is going on in here? All right, guys, I'm still out in Niles, Ohio here over at Eastwood Mall Complex. And I was driving around the mall just to see what was up over here. And I noticed uh, an abandoned Sears Auto Center here. Yeah, check it out. We got the Sears sign out front here. And there is a Sears in the mall that appears to still be open. There was a lot of cars around the other side there. But here's the, uh, the auto center here. And look at this awesome label scar up here on the front. That is really cool. Let's just walk over here and check it out. I did notice that they have paper up on the windows, but some of it's falling down so we can peek in. We're gonna do that first because security is riding around the mall here. And they already watched me filming the Kmart, so they probably know nothing's up, but you never know. Sometime they might decide to just be like, get this guy out of here. <laughs> All right, let's just take a peek in here quick. Yeah, look at that. What the? Must have turned into something else at some point. KX. What's that say? Exclusive Kingly? What the? That's weird. Okay. Let's walk around the other side here. Yeah, looking at the Sears from here, I mean, there is like nothing going on. There's one lady walking out to her car. <laughs> Three other cars sitting there. And that is it, but the other side was hopping. I was thinking maybe there'd be a label scar over here on the side of this. I don't see one at the moment, but possibly right down here. Looks like there's some markings from when there was a sign up there. Yeah, the, something going on in here. Guys, look at this, I'm so stoked. I had no clue, but as I walk by here, I see the open door and I'm like, what is going on in here? And then I noticed the old Sears sign back here. And then back here, there's even more letters. So let's get a close-up of these uh, letters right here. Look at this. I cannot believe I just happened to come out here today at the perfect time, and all these letters were just taken down. That is so cool. Unbelievable. And then just a couple more back there. That was so cool. <laughs> And guys, here's where those letters just were. I am blown away that they're right there inside the door. <laughs> I guess it's just all about being in the right place at the right time, man. I, I just, that's the coolest part of this trip. I went over there and filmed the, the old Kmart Supercenter, but that just totally stoked me out right there. Here's the back side of the building. I think this door over here is open, but that's from these guys working. Oh, I guess not. Yeah, look over here. We still have the auto center. Well, okay. This is strange. Look, it says auto center there, but those are not Sears letters. Look at this. There's the label scar from where it said Sears auto center. Those pr look pretty clean, but I wonder if they just put those up or if for some reason the old auto center uh, words were replaced at one point. That wouldn't really make sense. But maybe they just put these new ones up just to let people know, hey, this is an auto center and it's for rent. I don't know. <laughs> and you know, it would have been really, really cool to have gotten here when they were taking the letters down so I could actually film them doing that. But I'm not complaining, man. How lucky was that? These guys are just finished with what they're doing. It looked like they're just about to close up shop, close that door on the other side, and I walk by, and there it is. Amazing retail history. There it is, one more time from this side. I drove over an hour to get out here hoping I'd see some cool stuff, and I can definitely go home a happy man now.